Welcome back everybody, my name is Altamar and we are going to be continuing our Let's Play of Wasteland 2. In the last video we arrived at this base, um, we watched some poor guy get killed. I'm actually not going to go into there quite yet, I do want to go into there, arguably, but I want to see what's over here first. Also Galen is encumbered, so let's get rid of whatever he's- oh right, the Dragoon. I'll give that to someone else for now. Uh, shit. <laughs> Galen, wait. We'll wait for you. There you go. You can cart that around for a minute. We probably will use the Dragoon. Just because it's very static, or like static damage. And if we have a character that's not going to be moving a lot, there's really no downside to it. It's only because the AP requirements that it's kind of odd. This looks like a lot of people. Alright, let's go talk to some people. Uh, the strong scent of ammonia and bile assaults your nose. A small sign on the door reads, Occupied. Water, it looks clean. We can top off our canteen. Can everyone hear me? Come right up to the front if you can't. I don't bite, I promise. Excellent. Welcome to the New Citadel, home of Matthias, beloved founder of the children of the New Citadel. I know you're all eager to begin your new lives as evolved humans, but there are a few things we have to cover before we can welcome you into the Citadel, okay? Great. First things first, we're glad you're here. We can't wait to share with you the joys of being a child of the Citadel and an evolved human. Second, we know that some of you have suffered terribly, and we can fix that. But the evolved operation is much easier when you're in good shape, so if you're sick or weak, I... Are those the... Holy fuck, it's the Desert Rangers. Pilgrims, if you want to join the new Citadel, become an evolved, now's the chance to prove yourselves. The pilgrims who kill those rangers will be the first in line for the evolved operation. Get them. Okie dokie. That's a lot of guys. Why did they get all these shit first? That's not cool. I'm gonna throw a grenade in like the middle of them. The ones that don't get to move first. Alright. I don't want to use a good rocket launcher. Let's just use a normal grenade. I know I have a couple around. kill a whole bunch. There we go. That just whittled down their numbers quite a bit. Um, that kind of sucks. Actually, shoot the guards. Ow. Lux Canyon is probably going to go down. Did they kill one of their own guys for me? Because that's kind of awesome of them. Alright, um... Let's kill him. Not quite, but close. Wow, I am stuck in really bad combat here. Um... Oh. Oh, he died. Good. He did not. There's a lot of people around. Um, we're gonna shoot the 74 guy. And miss. I'm getting weird shadow bugs here. That's kind of odd. Oh. That's okay, he's he's mending, but he's also bleeding, so he's not going to mend. Kill those two. All we need to do is get him up, and then we can just heal him with a level up. Kill him. Let's go down to five and just start shooting individual ones. I 
don't think I'm gonna do any damage with my death ray because they are not very well armored. Oh right, shit, there's that guy still alive. I forgot about him. But I can move back. Good. Let's kill these two. Or at least that one. One hit point left on that guy. That's kind of annoying. Alright, let's finish him off. And finish him off. Let's get Lex Canium back up. I only have Master Trauma Kits, so. I'll have to deal with that. Oops. I didn't mean to switch weapons. That's a lot of followers we got experience from. Everyone gained a level. He had a sword and a jacket. And we got some other junk too. Let's level up. Copy Ranger Team Echo. Congratulations. What do we got for skills going in? Seven, not enough to do anything with. Hard ass, we can get ten. Why not? Um, 14 for Galen. Let's just leave it and see what we need. Smartass 9, I think, is what we're going to go with for her. 23 points, so let's just... I don't know. What can I get him? Not really. I don't know what these are even, still. Screw it. We'll max out field medic and surgeon. Done. Um, brawling is what you're gonna get points into. Let's get our canteens all topped up. And what is in here? Yes, let's go into there. We're going into the new Citadel location. Looks neat in here. It's a big place. A really big place. Alright, we're gonna go in this room first, just because I don't know where we're going. There's a chest in here. Some things. Children of the New Citadel are up there. Medical stuff. <laughs> you see an IBM AT on the table. The screen says, Wasteland 3, you shiver with anticipation. I like that, that's excellent. <laughs> wonder if I can play it. Let's go back. Oh no, I can't. I, that's the only thing I can do is just see it. Alright, um, we're gonna try and kill these guys. Let's get into some positions though. Because there is a lobber, so we want to spread out a tiny bit. Alright, let's approach everybody. I hit him once. I kind of meant to triple shot him, but he was not- oh my god, no. You huge idiot. That is not the time to lose control. Ugh, what a moron. Um, alright, uh, what do we got? Cutter, false gunner, basher, basher. No more lobbers? Okay, the lobber is the one that's gotta die first. I don't want any grenades coming in. That would be nice. The half pint has got low armor value, so. Didn't do a whole lot of damage to him. What are you? You are a wheels. I don't know what that means. In terms of, you know, stats or strikes. 
Okay, that one's dead. No! You idiot, why are you still in melee combat? Alright, we're gonna move up to there. Well, at least they suck at aiming. I'll give them that. Already killed that one off. And we're gonna shoot at that one. There was a chance we could have killed it in one hit, but sadly that did not happen. Yeah, that looks good to me. Kill the wheels. You know what toys I miss from back in my childhood? Hot wheels. At least he's not gonna die soon. I have an 87% chance to hit him. 88, let's finish that one off. And we'll shoot the Sim. Kill it. And we're gonna move up with this guy too, here, I think. Go up and in. That was a good shot, actually. Wow, that actually hurt quite a bit. I uh, can't see him. Can't see him at all. Go up to this guy and prepare to heal him for being a moron. I don't know if I should reward being an idiot with healing. Alright, what do we got? Junk. An ion beamer. But mostly just junk. And junk. And junk and junk and junk. Let's quickly disassemble these. Tactical scope, nice. That's actually a pretty good mod. High powered scope is kind of worthless at this point of the game. And laser sight is always good. Get rid of the high powered scope. In fact, let's get rid of all the low powered scopes too. They're just weighing me down, and we don't need them. We also don't really need money, so good to go. He has negative one perception, which is fine because he doesn't have perception to start with. Ammunition. Some energy cells and some worthless ammo that we're not using. Nothing up here yet. So let's say we're going around the perimeter of the building. This is a big building. Quite large. There are some more pulse gunners and cutters and a lobber. So it's a whole nother squad, basically. Mr. Jackhammer, you're gonna go here. Guys, you're gonna go there. Adama's gonna go here or so. Way over here. Yeah, just like that. Vulture's Cry is also gonna go way over here or so. There's a lot of junk in this place too. It clearly hasn't been finished being built yet. Brother Thomas, you can come up here. And Thrace, you're coming over here too. Oh crap, I got too close. Oh well. We'll be fine, I think. Oh, you have got to be shitting me.
All right, let's shoot the pulse gunner. Oh, uh, we're gonna shoot the lobber, I think. He did not die, unfortunately. Uh, we're gonna shoot the lobber as well, and he needs to die before he starts you know, throwing grenades. Um, he needs to move somewhere. Somewhere that he can shoot things. Right there, should be fine. Maybe not, maybe right here. Yeah. Kill that guy. Ow. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I should never have brought him to this place. He becomes incredibly hard to control here. Is Galen wearing armor? Oh yes, he's got that stupid 10 armor. No wonder he's dying. We gotta take that off like right away. He, they, like he's gonna get torn apart. More so than already is. We'll get rid of his armor immediately after this fight. Oh, I can't quite aim at him. Slightly too far away. Still too far away. But that's not too far away, so we'll shoot that one instead. At least he hits really hard. I'll give him that. Galen, you are going to go hide somewhere because, sweet Jesus, you need to not get hit. Sight block. need a multiple shot on that one, just finish him off. And shoot that guy. Getting there. I need you to actually go heal him. Tell me where to find locate Matthias. So yeah, he's just losing his freaking mind, which is putting our whole team in danger. So he is very powerful against synths. In retrospect, I shouldn't have brought him along though. I should have brought the other guy with an energy axe or whatever. But he does awesome damage, so I mean that is good. This, super not good. Just getting torn apart with it on. Um, laser sight, we'll keep that. And we'll keep all that junk, and that junk, and that junk, and that, and that, and that. Excellent. We are on our way. Wait, what was that thing? Ammunition. Let's go take a look. This place is rather huge. I'm going to give it that. If I get too encumbered, I'll just start dropping shit on the ground. I don't think we're going to need any of it later on. And what is this? Medical symbols. Medkit. I like medkits. They are super helpful in the whole not dying department. Is this another room full of monsters? And by monsters I mean synths. And by synths I mean yes, there are many synths in here. Okay, let's put you here. You here, you in the middle. Looks canium. You're gonna start the fight way over here so you don't go get killed immediately. We can at least take some out before you do something stupid. And guys, you can come here. That looks pretty good. Alright, you. Can't see anything. Now can you see? Excellent. You're also gonna come over here, I guess, and crouch. So you and you. 
our first up. You're gonna shoot that guy. Oh, I should have reloaded before. That's okay. You got lots of time before anything gets into shotgun range. I like how they're all abandoning their high ground. It's a lobber, we should kill the lobber first. Well, wow, since can ambush? I didn't even know that. Huh. Out of range, but not all over, out of range. Alright, that one it is. We need to kill that lobber. Oh, come on. Don't do that. Now I can't shoot something else for a lot of damage. I actually have to pick this stupid thing off. Just because I don't want grenades coming in. Alright, uh, finish that one. Good job. The jackhammer. Um, uh, come up here and wait. Actually, come right there and wait. Ow. Start killing the pulse gunners. They are the effective snipers of the group. It's a basher, that's a pulse gunner, and that is a gunslinger. Let's take on the gunslinger with him. Um, full auto, let's move forward one. Good enough. Kill that one. Good, excellent. We're doing great so far. Without Lex Canium to die, we're doing awesome. Basher and a pulse gunner. Finish off that gunslinger, I guess. Oh, now he's moving in. Good, he gave us a good head start on killing things before he decided to go do something stupid. Weapons don't do a whole lot of damage when you're using no armor. And shoot that one. Is it bleeding? I didn't think it could be bleeding. That's cool. I'm actually pretty okay with that. Let's kill that one a bit. her up. She can't really hit very well. She still can't hit very well. I guess she can shoot this one. I did not die, unfortunately. Or maybe I did from bleeding, but I'm not sure. It moved out of cover, but I can't see it, so that doesn't really help us. So we're gonna shoot this one. And now I can see it, though. They were both the same points. Let's kill that one. Lexcanium will apparently always lose control in this place. So, just as a heads up, if you bring him along, he will run and do dumb shit. Always, it seems. Ow. Uh, good. There we go. I was going to say give it a shot, but it seemed to work out okay. Lots more experience, good. I like this. And some junk. There's a minigun there. Who got the minigun? Let's just disassemble that before it becomes way too heavy. And this also can be disassembled into nothingness. There, done. Problem solved. Quick save, and we are moving on. There's a TV watching us, I don't like that. Some sort of vault door here. I think we're going the right way. It is in lockdown mode, and there's a trap on it. 
There's a trap that is a medium trap, even with 10 demolitions, so let's give it a shot trying to open it. We will uh, quick load if it blows up. And now how do we open it is the question. I'm guessing it's a computer science thing. Yes, it's also medium, so let's save before we do that. He failed. That's okay. Oh, he critically failed. Alright, reload time. Try that one more time. I want to get through this without failing. Maybe. I would appreciate not failing, actually. Excellent. Look at that. I think we probably have to go that way. If I was to hazard a guess, I would say that way, but I'm going to go this way too, just in case. Or maybe it's this way we have to go. There's a lock. I don't know, I want to see in the middle of this place. It seems sort of inner sanct to me, which I want to see. Another security thing. I think you can go either way. I think you can go this way into the... Oh, the door's here, though. I went the long way, apparently. Or maybe there's, there's a door in every room we could have gone into. I think we just ended up killing a whole bunch of creatures just for the heck of it, which is cool. I'm actually okay with that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is locked. Oh, we can't actually go in there. Oh, we can. We just have to open it. There's a pulse gunner in there, and some sort of basher. Hmm. This doesn't look like an inner sanctum thing. Although there are a lot of dudes in there. I'm just going to quickly check what this door is up here. Before we go any further, the opposite direction. Also, we're almost out of time, so I didn't want to start a whole new fight. I'm going to call on this level. And reload all my guns while I'm at it. Just a lock, no traps. I don't know if I trust that. Any alarms? Nope. Alright, I guess it just is. A straight up lock. I hear some weird sounds beyond though. It's a factory. An industrial grade synth. To the sleek lines of the synths you have seen before, this model looks like it is made for lifting heavy heavy cargo. For operating in hostile environments, its cold black lenses stare at you. The destroyers of Guardian Citadel. I've been waiting so long for this. What? what? Don't you know who I am? Yeah, you have the creepy voice. Besides, they don't know who I am. Can't you guess, Rangers? This is Dugan. My sworn enemy. The robot monster. I was going to save L.A. Genius, boss. Sheer genius. His voice is super awesome. Wait, Matthias is your boss? We're more like partners. We were both chosen by the Guardians to become exalted. And once the A.I. comes, we will rule the future together. Our minds linked in a way no human could understand. Okay. AI? What AI? You know it is the base Kochi's AI. But it has become far more than that. It is a god now. A creator. More than the Guardians ever were. And our savior as well. For it is the AI who will make Matthias and I one with every machine and computer in the world. We will be gods. 
What do you have to do with Guardian Citadel? It was my home once. And mine too. The Rangers drove us and the other Guardians from it when we were on the brink of Godhood. But it doesn't matter now. You have only delayed the inevitable. It is being prepared for our return as we speak. What? Your death struggles are nothing in the life of mortals like us. What do you mean by prepared? You haven't heard. Matthias has activated all the old, long hidden security systems in the Citadel and turned them against your friends. That's not good. Marcus and his butchers are likely all dead by now. And you soon will be. You don't think you can die? Our minds are transferred into our new body. They will be immortal. You might smash one of our bodies, even a hundred, but our minds can always be inserted into another. We will never die. You mean Dugan isn't your enemy? Every god is an enemy to inspire his followers to glory. Until you rangers showed up, I had to invent them. Then what better way to cover up all the resources we were stealing? I'd steal from the people. The Thighs would swear to protect the people from me. And together, we'd build more synths and augmented limbs with what we took. A win, win. You know that old joke about, if I told you, I'd have to kill you? I do know that joke. Well, we've told you. Now, we have to kill you. Fair enough. Well, not us. What do you mean? We're too busy getting ready to invade Arizona. Ah, you're gonna do the bad guy thing where you leave me to die against something else. Robots, attack! It's only two robots. It's not that bad. Okay, um, can I save in combat? No. So I'm not gonna save. I'm just going to end the video as soon as it's one of my characters turn and then I'll do my next video right after this one and that way we can just continue with this fight right off the bat. Like always if you have any suggestions or comments please leave them below otherwise I'll see you next time.